Hello everyone, so today I am here to show you guys what I plan on reading in the month of May. May could be like an awesome reading month, or it could be a horrible reading month, I'm not totally sure. I get out of high school, I am out of high school on May 25th, so I have a lot of like senior obligations and like I have to get ready for graduation and all that stuff, but also at the same time for like the three weeks leading up to that, I'm probably going to be doing absolutely nothing, like I'm probably going to have so much time on my hands in class and outside of class. So I feel like it's probably going to be a really good reading month, but I don't really know. I also really have no idea what I want to read this month. I'm currently in the middle of three books, um, and like I have a couple in mind that I would like to get to, but I honestly like don't know. But the first book that I'm currently in the middle of is Comfort Women by Nora Okja Keller, which is a Korean novel about women during the Korean War, Japanese War, something like that. Um, in the Korean refugee, oh, Korean refugees of World War II. Um, and this is just a very short little book. I am currently, like, 65 pages into it, and I am enjoying, like, one section of it. It's told from the daughter's point of view and the woman who actually has experienced, has experienced World War II, her point of view. And I'm really enjoying her point of view, but the daughter's point of view is very boring. So I might put it down, I'm not totally sure, or I might just fly through it because it's like 200 pages long, so. I am also finally reading The Raven King by Maggie Stiefvater. This was a roller coaster. I originally was not going to order this book because I wasn't sure if I wanted to read it or not. If I'm completely honest, I have been so let down by like every finale I've read in the past little bit, so I wasn't sure if I really even cared to read this. I finally decided to pre-order it. I pre-ordered it. On the day of the release, it was said there are no more, they're out of stock. They said my copy would be coming in June, which I was like, are you joking? And then it was suddenly like May 15th, and then it was suddenly May 3rd, and it finally came, so I started it, and I'm only a couple of pages into this one, I'm only 35 pages into it, but I am very much appreciating that Maggie kind of like gives a quick little summary of like everything that's happened in the past three books or I would be very lost. And the third book that I am currently in the middle of is Hear the Wind Sing and Pinball by Haruki Murakami, which is the buy-up of Haruki Murakami's first two novels. It recently came out in the vintage paperback edition, which I obviously like the best. I had really so wanted to start reading his novels more in chronological order, so um, I picked up this. I had actually been waiting for it to be released. It was only released today. I got mine early. Um, but it was only released today, so I'm very, very excited to start reading his work in, like, chronological order and see, um, how he develops and everything. It's been very strange reading this first book compared to some of his newer works, so it's very entertaining. And I am only 17 pages into this one, but each book is only, like, 100 pages long. But I also really like this edition because it is, like, like... It's upside down! It's so funny! I was reading in class and someone was like, Kate, okay, why is your book upside down? And I'm like, it's not. It's two-sided. But other than those three books, I'm not totally sure what I want to read. I have two that I'm like, I want to read, but I'm not sure if I want to read them right now. And that's The Lies of Locke Lamora by Scott Lynch, and The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo by um, Stieg Larsson, which is actually my mom's book. So that's why I wasn't in like a book haul or anything. But these are two books like that I would really like to read at some point, but <clears throat> not sure if I'm totally in the mood for them or not right now. But these might be on the list, but I'm not sure. This month I cannot figure out what I am in the mood to read. But these are the three books that are very solidly on my TBR considering I am in the middle of all three of them. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm very excited for the Raven King and wind up uh, in the Hear the Wind Sing in Pinball. Anyways, I love you guys and I will see y'all soon. Bye!